Hi, this is Nicola Kirsch. Um, let me show you the plugin I am developing right now. So this is a multi-tool. Uh, this video is a quick, um, quick um, tutorial to show you how to work with uh, texture, tilde texture. So we are setting a resolution of 1K. We have the need of a framer and sub tool. Um, you have twice time the the same mesh. This is in useful to have a, a version so you can create several layers for your final texture. So this one is ready accepted that you need to subdivide it till we are at the nine level with a little bit more than two million polygon let's draw it on the canvas frame it uh, when we use the warp mode we need to set this to from properly so when we get back here now with a frame enable the warp mode enabled one when I'm bent on this border it reproduce the stroke on the other side so just make something fast to show you how um, the workflow is to complete final tillable texture so this is uh, enough just to introduce the purpose so to frame, to make a render, there is a specific, special subtool, and you must to frame on it. Because let me explain you why. There is a a marge. The document is not ten twenty four, but in fact is ten thirty six. So when you render with BPR, it make uh, possible to fix the scenes properly without the use of spot healing brush in Photoshop. Uh, so let do a render. Be sure the shadows are not enabled can render in material mode there is nothing here so just check the option want the visible um, PSD file and material so it's okay just render should be quite fast Now there is a um, section for exchange with a PSD file editor with matte for shaded you hit click this icon and it open the texture in Photoshop. So let me show you why there is a margin on the document because BPR create this border and texture group is repeating the last uh, pixel row so it the result is wrong uh, to me the best method to fix this is simply have a bigger resolution and when you go here you simply uh, go back uh, 
at the target resolution proceed then now everything should uh, repeat properly so we do an offset so you see the value and perfect seems no word that's all for that tutorial thank you for following